All right, we're good. We're good. So today's chapter six. We're on a boat. I probably should have told you to buy torch stabs last map, but uh, oops. Eh, who needs torches? That's so true. We're both confident and assertive. We don't need it. I assume you know what this is from. Actually, no, you might... I don't think you're a fan of this series. It's, a uh, Final Fantasy VI overall music. Or Final Fantasy It sounds like It sounds like croc arrogant. music. I'm so confused. Like what music? Croc. Oh, like the platformer? Yeah, the goaded platformer. <laughs> I'm surprised I've heard someone mention it. I've just, like, seen images of it. It's, it was, it's my first video game ever. Ah, sick. Honestly, the first game I remember playing was Super Smash Bros, but it was me doing the Kirby down B spam. So. What the fuck is Arvis doing here? Uh, check out his name. When you, like, look at the map preps. What, why is Arvis a pirate? You'll see. I'm so confused. What? Sorry if I'm low on energy today, I'm really tired. Nah, you're good. Alright. So, what's the deployment slots looking like? Oh, fuck you. And we'll just, yeah, keep undeploying Fiona. Really. Nothing more to it. Um, what lances do? We yeah, I did buy javelins, right? <laughs> so you have one now. Should be good on like weapons. So what are these? This death again? Yeah, just spreads poison. Wash hands after use. Alright, give me the other thunder. We don't need to use Elfire just yet, I think. Uh, you should be good, I think, on weapons. Yeah. Oh, you, you can deck Wario out because he's the three weapon types oh, now. Oh, true. What am I, yeah. And then I'll just buy you a heal. Um, also, Ricardo getting free real estate by, uh, <laughs> by having Thief Vision. I'm 99% sure. True. Actually based. Hold on. Oh yeah, and I can sell this. And give you the divine that we bought. There might be a torch in the prep menu? I can't remember. I doubt it. I heavily doubt it. Uh, and then I'll just give you whatever I'm missing. Not, not, um, the prep shop. Oh wait, Fiona? Yeah, I'll give Fiona's Iron Lance, I guess. I don't really, I don't think I need a pure water just yet. I'll put it in a convoy. Put all of these in a convoy. Um, sorry, I'm totally out of it. Hold on. Can you still? Yeah, I can give you an Iron Blade too. You yeah, need one. Yeah, weapon triangle's so fucking big in this hack too. Like, don't yeah, think. yeah. Huh. I guess I'll just put it over the. I have three healers. I can put it over the boulder. Right? Um. Yeah. No, I think we should be fine now. Then, right? That's everything. Uh. Oh yeah, I wanted to give you an iron blade. Or did I want to give it to? No, 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 no. Delvin has enough weapons. Yeah, you iron blade instead of iron sword. All right, okay. That should be good. Battle preps are done. Um, there's pirates. They said there's a few archers. Wait, you probably can't see the boss yet. Once you're there, it's a really funny. Um, it makes a lot of sense. All right. I'll just put you in the back. Also, not to be a backseat gamer, but make sure you put Priscilla right, I think, on the stair- Or, not Priscilla, Rebecca on the stairs, I believe. Okay. Then I can just Like, do have this. her wait there. Yeah. Then I'll absolutely just do that. Move you 
up. Alright, this should be good. Is there any other secrets in this? Um, I don't believe so. Well, no we didn't. Eat shit. Oh, I forgot how hard she telegraphed it. <coughs> Fuck. Personal bow. Wildflower. It's kind of cracked. <laughs> All right. Um, because she can actually use that after she reclasses too. So oh she fuck can just you, go Steel Bow! Oh, I don't, I don't need that shit anymore. Yeah, basically, Wildflower lets her just become a flyer that she becomes a Kinshi Knight, basically. You get more than a few hammers. Is this is this a is this a Donkey Kong Country track? Oh yeah. I don't know if, if uh, Darif will mention it, but 4X was like also a Danganronpa track. This game has every music. She did not mention so you, that. You didn't react to me posting you the TLP music in your DMs. I'm so sad. I didn't listen to it. I'll listen to it later. If you want to hear the better version of the Cynthia theme. Honestly, just move full mo nah, I'll put you here. Yeah. Probably smarter for, like, you know. You, ha award. you can be here. You'll be right behind. Oh, I, I could have already gotten the support. Damn. Sad. So I can move club. up here. Okay. Alright. Not a lot of thinking, like, this, I don't really like Fog of War maps, there's really not much commentary I can do, because I don't really see shit. Um, I had a really fun, like, not to, like, constantly mention I make a hack, but one of the funniest lines of feedback I've ever gotten from someone was, you know, this, like, you could make a good Fog of War map, or you can just, like, make two great maps in that normal amount of time to, like, fine-tune it. <laughs> or you can and just, like, not. Yeah, like... Like, you can make a good, fine Fog of War map, but it's just like... Why would you? <sighs> yeah. That's my Whoa, question. he doesn't double? Yeah, I'm surprised. As, as, I'm, I'm, I'm as surprised as you are. Doesn't he, doesn't he have, like, really good speed, too? 18. How much speed do... It? Damn. Oh, damn. They're min-maxed. They're, they're starting to look like the fucking brigands for my, my garbage hack. <laughs> This is an inflation hack for sure. Have a rotten day. Can you like? You can't double, but. Hmm. Oh, I'm just I'm just gonna grab this kill with. Oh yes, the pool. What the hell is wrong with the sound? Yeah, I'm confused too. So it's like some weird Undertale text font. Maybe it's just the music. Maybe. Oh my god. He said Among. He said Among. I saw it too. Alright, that's only B support. Actually, kind of a funny slash annoying quirk. Oh, yeah. crit. Um, is that like for some reason this hack has like I think it might have unlimited A's for characters, oh. but it it Based. always lets you like see the support again. Also, like each character only has like one paired ending, so it does so that's how it avoids conflicts. Okay. It's always fascinating to see how different hacks do different support mechanics. <laughs> I'm just gonna do this. This, like, this is just like, I don't know. For for me, like, you mixing, you're mixing like pirate ships, which are either annoying or boring, and then fog of war maps, which are either really annoying or boring. And this happens to just be boring. A mix of boring. 
At least so far. My, I don't know. I, I, I just, I'm, not, I'm not huge on Fog of War. I hate Fog... I, I, I really don't like Fog of War. Yeah, it's... It's only if you have, like, enough tools guaranteed, but... Oh, magic again. Not... Oh, Adept. You know, that makes up for the speed. Yeah. That definitely does. Uh, might as well chip. Really nothing else I can do here. Um... I could, like... Cause I was planning to have the mages one round the armors. If I can't get rid of this pirate, then that's kind of not looking possible. Oh wait, uh, generic support Stelvin. Yeah, I'll check that out if I... I'm actually gonna stick with that. If you go through with it, yeah. You have an Axe Reaver, I forgot. Yeah, do that. I'm actually tempted to send you the ROM I use, just if you can see more supports than the default ones if you want to. Like, you can just transfer saves easily. Alright. So you can grab this kill fairly confidently. I think or... with the support, it might go up to like... No, I think this Very is good. better. Oh right, longbow exists. Yeah, alright. I like this more. I like this more. Yeah, now Hugh can bonk in armor. Yeah. And then Sephiroth can as well. Alright. As long as Sephiroth, like... Yeah, this should be fine. Good. Armors have like zero speed in the sack. In a good way. Oh god. Did not like getting hit there. Mathis has provoke, so Mathis needs to be the one to be healed here. Yeah, make sure. Yeah, just do this. No nobody's gonna get attacked if Mathis is there. I'm gonna have soldier Has anyone up. in your army fucking dodged this map? <laughs> what? Has any one of your your units dodged this map? Apparently not, no. Love the strength levels. What a chad. You can technically cycle through a lot of classes with the reclass system. It's a little jank though to like... Because you just need so many levels. Mm -hmm. But if you really want Q to go physical, I think you can. <laughs> it's not worth it. I don't think I'm gonna do that. And then I'll just do this. If you want a terrible meme, you can always do a uh, Merc Priscilla. Terrible isn't it's a good but also terrible unit. Good meme but terrible unit. Oh, also Priscilla does get swords on promotion. She goes to like Mage Knight. Ah, interesting. Um, it's part also Wildflower reference, I think. I can't remember anymore. She might get both in Wildflower. It's been a bit. There's so many updates while I played it. Um, what is going on in this map? I'm so confused. I'm just gonna do this. So I can see what's going on over here. Smart. Really nothing. There's really just nothing yeah. going on. Yeah, <laughs> I kind of forgot about this map except for the boss. This is such a nothing map. Wait, support. Do you have a support? Nope. It's just a spoiler. Yeah, I'm like, after this map, I'm going to send you a ROM. Just so you can, like, see a few more supports. And, like, also not get spoiled. Might as well just have... Yeah. I'm gonna have you, like, like go there's no here. Other changes. You and you go here. The sudden music change every time I heal with Sephiroth. <laughs> God, I, music I have no idea. I'm just, I'm struggling so hard to uh, talk about anything interesting in a map where there's nothing interesting going on. So like, um, so I'll just start up a topic then. Yeah, show, uh, show your hack more or something. I don't... <laughs> <laughs> um, is this where I talk about Amori? No. <laughs> How about not? <laughs> There's actually a one month hack. Comp like you have like you had a few weeks to make like a one chapter hack thing. It was like called Marth. Make a terrific. 
okay. hack. A really terrific hack. And um, I, while I was brainstorming ideas, I had one friend condescendingly say, Hey, make a Mori hack. And I went, fuck you, I will. And then I actually made one. And I went pretty try-hard on it with, like, custom eventing. And I almost, like, try to simulate emotion changing in every conversation. Yeah. And I did not hate myself enough for that. But it was a pretty fun experience to do custom eventing, custom tile sets, custom backgrounds. Um... But yeah, honestly, if you'd like just a one-chapter hack, I do recommend to you and the audience to check out that entire thread, because there's some really neat hacks there. Um, there's like Storage Gaiden. Storage is a really cool short hack where you kind of just pick your units off with a bunch of cash you have at the start. Um, nice. Oh, nice level. Hack and check speed. Nice. Uh, there's also something called the Closing Act, which is such a concept. It is literally at the end of a failed Chinese rebe peasant rebellion where you're literally just the scraps of rebellion trying to like just destroy information about what village is signed up um that's really cool um what else did i play there's a four kings little fun gaiden which i like since i'm a four king simp um some people really don't like it i'm a big fan but let's not get into that now <laughs> i have no i don't know uh, anything about four kings <laughs> There's just dumb drama, but there's dumb drama about a lot of things. Nice crit. Nice crit. crit. Nice Oh, crit. Mario, my god. I mean, I'd put the Sword Reaver on because I remember it having higher crit. It's literally the only reason. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. It's so dumb. Because I remember GBA Reaver, 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 GBA Reaver Actually, weapons have like five crit each or something like that. It might have removed it in this, but yeah, it's so funny. Like, just so pointless like oh they're weapons that like increase reliability except they also just have crit <laughs> um okay <laughs> okay all right that better be a reference to Marth being able to walk on water in the original game. You know, I think it might be a reference to another FE1 comic, or the another FE1 Let's Play. You know, with the J. Yeah, yeah. I, I know, I know it's exactly that one. What was I supposed to look up? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There's something I really wanted to. Yes, the Reaver. Oh, they removed the crit. Okay. So I didn't. Yeah, it, it wasn't Calvary. a high. It wasn't a high IQ play. I didn't check the stats, I was just like... It's still a good call against the Merm. Yeah, I guess. Um, yeah, you're just a ranged person. I'm gonna have to heal. You can, uh, you can go heal you. Okay, I got a topic that'll get you... I'd be surprised if it doesn't get you worked up or talked about it. Do you think Fire Emblem 4 is going to be the next game in system, Intelligent I, Systems Remake? I, I'm not 100% guaranteed anymore, but it is extremely likely. I think it's an about 50% chance, especially because of how much attention Sigurd specifically got in yeah, Engage. That's what I was going to emphasize. He is the emblem that's around the most. Like, yes. If you count it. Yeah, he has the most availability, he has the most relevance in the story right after Marth. Like, it, it's, it feels too deliberate, right? Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna do this, Warrior's yeah, fine. I... I'm a number one! Did I, um... <laughs> I made a really dog shit pretend philosophical Reddit post about this, but... I talked about how Lucina, the meta narrative of Emblem Lucina, is one of the most fascinating design things I've ever seen for a story. We get to see a company discuss the popularity um, and reputation of one of its breakout characters. Where Lucina starts off as an enemy to all the old classic emblems that didn't sell well, but then at your moment of need the most engage, she's your savior. Also, same with Lynn. Casual saving the fire emblem, which, <laughs> spoiler alert for Engage, is a lair. You're reading it way uh, too much. Engage is not that deep. <laughs> oh no, it's totally what they're going for. Engage it's is not that deep. I, I promise you. It's why all the ports are like emblems. 
do it so poorly. The game, the Why game, the game where they go on the, on the on the youngest princess. She's obviously a metaphor for violent grooming. <laughs> the game where they go, we the twelve emblems combined our power to make you the thirteenth emblem, the fire emblem. I is is probably it's not that deep. <laughs> Oh, I, there's a lot of story moments I really like in that game, but it's not a it's it's not well written in the slightest. It's so funny. Like I can't tell if the person who wrote it was like, oh, you know, what, I'll just do Awakening again if they're successful, or they literally don't know how to write anything else. <laughs> I mean, it, it is, it, it, it is Nami. It is not. They brought Nami back, and this time they were like, okay, so you ruined the series enough in Fates and uh, Awakening. How about we let you be the lead writer now? Wait, were they not? Oh wait, this is the default. Uh, no, but I, I'm pretty sure they okay, were just. They uh... were really funny to the port chain in my version. Oh, oh. Okay, here, this is a great one. Speaking of FE4, right? Oh yeah. I love FE4. It is my like top three Fire Emblem <laughs> game of all time. It's a weird game. I've been meaning to do it like a proper replay. I keep thinking like maybe I'll play binary instead. Though. I I, I will. I, I've planning. I've been planning. If I ever play the game again, I will do it for this channel because I will do a substitute ranked run because I think that's oh, fucking shit. hilarious. Charlotte Delvin hype. I fucking just love their like artwork differences. <laughs> yeah, it's so hilarious because like one is like a really really good custom portrait and the other one is just a straight up port. Oh wait, the text came back. What the fuck? What happened? There must just be something with the music in the background affecting it has the sound to, effects. It has to be something like that. So, so I mean... God, why are they... Oh my god, break the matrix! <laughs> I don't blame you. <laughs> True <laughs> hidden events. <laughs> Why do substitutes get more characterization than the game with limited characterization than the actual important children do? I really just I I like FP4 and I'm pretty much a Gen 2 defender, but I really do not no, care Gen about two, most of the kids that are Gen 2's story I mean, is no. good. Zelif is a just a straight up like a good protagonist, in my opinion, Selif is uh, a better, oh, a better Marth. Me. In my opinion, Selif no, is just a... actually my like favorite Fire Emblem character. I don't know if I, I don't, say that no, you, you said that last time, and I'm like, I like okay, Marth yeah. by the way. I, I love Marth. He's like really he's cool. He, he's just like together. nobody, nobody can hate him, right? But it, for, for me personally, Selif is just a more interesting Marth. It's just that he's in a game with too little writing to really utilize that, and that's why I'm really hoping that the next game is an F uh, FE4 remake. Because that's the one thing that that game is missing, and that is character writing. It has everything else going for it, and the character writing that it has is perfect. It's 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 yeah, like, it's a lot phenomenal. Of conversation, the hidden yeah, the, village thing. But that's like that's so for such tryhard fans. Like that's, yes, but it's so limited, and that's why like if you just it, if you just remake also, it, keep everything the same, and then just add supports. That's you know it. Fire you have a perfect self, game. Exactly right. You know, uh, Christian Lamont. Self. Yeah. Yeah, it's so perfect. Like you, I could not imagine a better voice for him. He, I was really surprised when I was like, "Damn, Self is Ignatz," and then I actually heard it, and I was, I, I was even more surprised that it just worked. Like it actually um, just works. It's really funny. I have some friends that like have like the worst like interpretations for their voice actor for their favorite characters, and I'm like, meanwhile, I'm, like so lucky. It's like, oh, this is a great line. This is a great sell -off. I was gonna um, bring this up actually just a minute ago, but like one voice that I've always been really, really negative on is uh, Lynn's. I think she was oh, done yeah, was really wonderful. fucking dirty. Uh, that's yeah. It was like a Lynn and a Hector fan. I know, and they're like they just die inside. Oh, and Lilina. I, like, I think just... I think Hector's is fine. I don't think Hector's is too bad. It, it's goofy. I think he deserves a little yeah. better. I don't think it's bad. Lynn is actively just uh, against it's the so character. Funny. It is a talented voice actress. She does good things and other stuff. I think they just but, miscast her real bad. I feel like, but the thing is, Smash already cast her almost perfectly. If you had just reused that same voice actress. 
in Heroes and Warriors, I feel like she would have fit the character much better. I, um, I don't know. I, yeah. I just like Lin's Smash voice way more. I can't even think of what it is. It's, it's she's just like a it's just a really deep voice. It's like basically almost like what Fiora has. I don't think Fiora's voice fits her either in Heroes, but like if you gave Fiora's voice it. to Lin, if you gave Fiora's voice to Lin, I think it would fit way way better. Um, actually, I also can't even unhear Lin because not to out myself as a fan of a tank and rope. I'm sorry to say the the Lin's voice actor's voice is like the most intentionally vulgar character, and then you get to find out like post fact that she's also the voice director. So Ain't she no had way. adept. Oh wait, he didn't get it. Oh, and of course he got hit. Oh. This is by the way not looking great. Like, this is actually just actively not looking great. I have to get rid of, like, all these guys. These guys I don't really need to care about. I think with Athos, as long as he can block a stair, you'll be good. Um, oh, he'll show But yeah, she's also on. good. But yeah, when... Lin's voice actress, like, Linda Lee. She does a good Athena and Ace Attorney as well. But it's just... They just don't direct her good. Yeah. Like, main like, heroes. It's like, I'm not saying that she's bad. a bad actress. I'm just saying she doesn't fit Lin in the slightest. Yeah. Uh, who else do I like? Uh, you know what's funny? Uh, Greg Chun. I kind of like his, like, some of his roles, but then... Oh my god, his Ike. It's like... <laughs> everything else he does but Ike is pretty good. I don't know, I like... It just makes that... I don't know... Does he do, does he do Ike and everything? Because I like the Raspy. I like the Raspy Ike uh, for Radiant Dawn. I just think if they oh. ever did Path of Radiance again... Oh, Greg Chun was, um... Only for going forwards in like Smash Four. Yeah, yeah, because I, I, yeah, I don't know. It's weird. The the Ike we haven't engaged, right? The the raspy voice yeah. Ike. You I think know, actually, I think he's gotten better. He has gotten better over time. I think he's I think, I think he's good for Radiant Dawn. I think he's genuinely good for Radiant Dawn. But uh, but if if you want to keep the same voice actor, if you ever want to remake uh, Path of Radiance, I genuinely just re recommend like directing him to be like have more energy and be younger and be more like I don't know have ha have more fire in that voice because. Um, yeah, actually, now that I think about it, I did always like Engage Ike. Maybe it's just like he got better at, over time. Because I know he did Eldigan too, and his Eldigan did like a 180 in Heroes. Um, which is really cool. Uh, it's like you gotta listen to the Ballroom one or whatever. Mm. Also, here's my super hot character, Fire Emblem character take, which people are gonna for probably grill me for. But uh, I'm not an Anna fan. I think she's bad in almost every single oh. incarnation she's in. It's like How, she's only pretty funny in Awakening, and then after that, it's she, downhill. She's funny there, but she's still a bad person. Like, I, I, I she just bad. has like a yeah. few comics, a, a comedy support. Like, like, I can't speak today. Like, she's the only person to make Tiki mad, and that's pretty funny. Like, <laughs> so, uh, I, I don't blame people for liking her for like comedic aspect, but as a character, she is unbearable. However, here comes the weird stance where I'm at. Engage Anna. It's like an actual person. I have heard a lot of people like her. I kind of and it's just surprising to me because like I don't like the decision to make her a child. Obviously, there there's so many like the fact that Nami's behind the game and and, and like it's more Fates esque anyway. And we know what's hap what happened with kids in Fates. It's also, just ooh, ooh, do you want to hear some really spicy speculation? I've heard speculation that they got rid of paired endings in Engage, despite knowing how popular they are in Three Houses, so they could like make it more of an emphasis for the supposed FE4 remake game next. That would be that would be pretty. That, that, I wouldn't mind that at all. Um, I don't but what I was trying weird. to say, what I was trying to say is that uh, fuck, what is I talking about now? Yeah, Anna. Uh, because she actually has a list of supports now. She also just has moments that make her like more than just a war profiteer and a scummy one at I, that. Because she's a I child even, like, gone, like she's a child that's been taken away from her, or not, not taken away, that's left her family, right? And she has moments where she actually just breaks down because she misses them. And it's like, yeah, no, like, honestly, that's not even because she has support. That's just like an actual character. Exactly, goal. right? And then in the credit like, scene, when you see Anna. In, oh, that like was in so the, cute. right, she's like you see her with her sisters, and it's like wow, I actually Wait, feel for this character now. No, oh, I'm because I can heal her. Oh, okay, right. Okay. I was thinking the pirate on the right side of the boat. No, 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 I just, 
Do those, do those pirates don't move. If there's any other pirates behind, then I'm fucked. But like, these two oh, don't move. Okay. I was just planning on doing this. Fog of War peak. No, I was actually just planning on doing this. Okay, I was not aware you were going to use physics, but that's... I have it for a reason, right? <laughs> also, this game is pretty generous with physics. I definitely don't feel like porting it. And then I just do this. Do you, do you have a two-range weapon? Yes, okay, then I will just enter it. I also do find it really funny how they swap names for the swords. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. Because it's the yeah. translation error. I, I honestly wonder if it was semi-delivered just since the names. It's really funny to me how Treehouse is like very consistently bad at translating. But then it has like this rare, yeah. th these rare few moments where it just, uh, where they actually led to like better storytelling. Like, you know the whole, um, how Burger, Burger King, how Black Knight lived. <laughs> In Radiant Dawn. Uh, I, I don't think that's Treehouse. I can't remember, though. It is a translation thing, though. It might not yeah, be Treehouse, but it's a translation thing. Because well, in, in English, his explanation is so much better. Oh, for sure. No, I know exactly what you're talking about. It's like, I've, I had a good joke about this with friends, where it's like, you know the dumbass two-path meme? Um, it's literally that, but like with 8-4 versus like Treehouse. <laughs> Well, I mean, eight four is peak, but I'm just like I'm just saying, Treehouse. I I know that eight four was behind Shadow Dragon, uh, Shadows Shadow of Valentia, SOB, and Three Hopes. Three Hopes and one other game. Uh, Awakening. Uh, yeah, Awakening, which is why Awakening is also just peak writing. Uh, it's not peak story, but it's like specifically like you know character writing. Like every support yeah, no, is I... good. It's it's I mean, ridiculous. Not say everyone, but like a lot of them. We don't <laughs> ex excluding now. We ask supports. Every support is good. Yeah. Um, how could you? I'm guessing you're also repressing now. Nah. <laughs> now nah, just existing. And I'm also um, trying to ignore like. Who's the? I, one, who's the no, one no, kid that, well, yeah. I'm point thinking, is, yeah, now he has good supports too. Now we now we Tharja support is one of the best supports in the game, and it's like I I, I wish this wasn't tied to a terrible character, right? You know what I feel like? I feel like Tharja is someone who's so fascinating, instantly flanderized by the source media. Like, no, literally, I... <laughs> by the time of the Awakening DLC, she just was a different character. No, in every single incarnation after Awakening, she's just terrible. She's actually just terrible. Yeah. Uh, including so Rajat. Oh my god, please stop getting hit. Yeah, I don't know if you've missed... Like, I haven't been close to, that close to watching, but it's like the opposite of your luck last map. Okay. Uh, you have a Silver Axe. I'm oh, just gonna shit. do this. And then I'm gonna oh, go here man. with Wario. Actually, I'll go here with Wario. Uh, no, I think you should two range at hard then kill finish with Wario. Oh shit. No, I'm gonna do this with Wario. I'm just gonna double check that Burkham doesn't die. He dies and fucking terribly too. God. What you? You probably get doubled too, right? Uh. Oh actually, my God, you don't. <gasps> what a goat. No, then this is what I'm gonna do. Hold on. <laughs> Iron Blade. Wait, I need to think this through. You go here. Right. Yeah, I actually completely nice forgot about this map. Nice crit. Nice crit. <laughs> hey, this map is just not good. But like, why would you fuse two terrible concepts? Just skip the boat map. Like, you don't have to have the boat map. You can just not do the boat map. It's actually really funny. My hack has a boat map, and it was kind of originally filler-ish, but, like... <laughs> and then I had a person who's basically been promoted to my co-writer after going, Yeah, I'll play your hack, give you updates. He basically reworked it into something that guides the rest of the plot while making it work, because we realized I was, like, off on a trajectory of the elite map. <laughs> Damn. That's still so funny. Like, it's 49 I... minus 13. That's not a kill. Uh, Sephiroth takes a hit. Yeah, but you also, but you also have on one range. Okay, hold on. Watch this. You go right here. You don't need to. Wait. My king. If you double physic here, you should be good. I only have one healer left. What's 16 plus 29? Oh, I already used Earl. I forgot. Uh. Not a kill. Wait. It's not oh, a kill. Just... I think if you just have Wario kill there, yeah. It's not a kill. I can heal Sephiroth and I'm fine. Oh, I was thinking you're just going to have Metathus body block. I can do that too. Yeah, Metathus, Metathus um, vulnerary up. And then um, 
Wario get physics. Um. Okay, hold on. One thing at a time. You get you get fucked. Can you like not get hit now? Oh, f <laughs> this is just a chapter where everybody gets hit. It's not like a just single dodge. You. Uh, I guess I'll just take the kill with Rebecca. Yeah. I don't even think I need to math this because I can heal Sephiroth and the warrior will go for Sephiroth. Oh, that's true too. Oh well. Then again, if there's a single other enemy here, Wario dies. So you, ha you, mm. does Sephiroth have a vulnerary? No. Wi-Fi you... died for one second, and I got so scared. <laughs> you don't have a vulnerary. Oh, uh... oh wait, he doesn't have supply yet. Uh, soldier. You have two uh, vulnerarys. You maybe... Yes. You could also trade chain potentially. Wait, fuck. Wait, no. I, I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> I got it. I can support, probably. Yes, yeah, support's a free action. Yeah. Then I can trade. Vulnerary. Give me, like, literally anything here. Take. Drop. There. Then I go here. Axe Reaver, Vulnerary. And then I go... Oh, you can stay right there. Which would be good. Okay. 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 And then we'll, one uh, warrior. Might be a thief. That's fine. My king. We're good. I was so ready for an archer just to run up. <laughs> yeah, I took way too many steps there. Like, that could have probably been a lot simpler, but I didn't really feel like thinking about it. That makes sense. <laughs> Honestly, the better I get a Fire Emblem, the more... Uh, Fire Emblem just becomes like I only need to think when it comes to making my actions easier, not not when it comes to surviving. Because yeah, I can survive, I can like I can survive in like multiple ways. So when it comes to thinking, I, uh, that's just like that, that only comes up when I want to make it as quick and efficient as possible. But if it were up to me, I could just turtle five hours. I mean, no, that's that's definitely why Fire Emblem is always interesting because it's always like you have room to improve, get better. Uh, play more aggressively and make it work. That's definitely why Fire Emblem was fun to me. Mm. Like, that's also why you can replay games. Like, yeah. if I only want to play a game and then do the exact same strategy every time, what's the point? Yeah. No, you're totally right. Jeez, already angry? What the fuck? Look, I love spamming. No, I mean, it's just been like one and a half. Or, I guess two. One and a half. All right, I don't know what's going on up here, just, but like, what does Hugh do to the? How far do you move? I can body block with Mathis and Axe Reaver, right? Hugh could like... probably take one. I don't know. Oh, you should maybe move up Ricardo first, just to see enemy ranges. You're probably not wrong. Might as well. Clearly, you should rig. Uh. Maybe I just don't... here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. There doesn't seem to be anybody. I'm just gonna... Unless you do more damage. You do. But you're just less accurate. I can sneeze. Oh yeah, the animation's funny. Alright, let's do a sneeze. Oh, just crit. Sure. Oh. <laughs> Alright. That solves all my problems. Average UW. Watch him get strength and defense and nothing else. And that works too. He's capped magic now, right? I don't have any. Ma the problem is I don't have any master seals, so like. This game's pretty generous with them, so it should be fine. Oh wait, no, I forgot. It's higher caps than. GBA. Oh right, me too. I, I forgot that myself. 
All right, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna charge forward. I'm gonna play it safe. Just put these two here. Yeah. Uh, you could probably have Wario charge forward just since it's Wario. I mean, to and be fair, then... yeah. Uh -oh. Wait, do you move? No, you don't. What is your weapon? Killer Lance Javelin. Okay. Eh, sure. God. Crit. Crit. Aw, sad. Watch Wario get fucking exploded now. Would be pretty funny. Oh. Uh. <laughs> well, there's nothing I could do anymore. Mathis provokes, so, like, Soldier's gonna be fine here. Yeah, I think Wario will be fine. Unless he gets, like, super bodied, but I don't know how. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Love getting luck on my hop on guard unit. Mm, oh, he's fine. Okay. Another one. Of, if it's only these three, he'll be fine. But if it's a single other enemy, he's kind of fucked. Dude, but how are they going to reach Okay, him? okay. Clutch dodge. Oh my king. He dodged the 70. Maybe I shouldn't listen to you and shouldn't charge ahead. And... Why? God, that animation is so weird. That uh, Lance turned so jiggly. I, yeah, I, that's something I've always noticed too. Okay. What? That's oh, right. fine. The boss is up here, so it doesn't really matter. Everyone's moving up. Do you want to put Ricardo up just so you could like see the yeah. boss area, so to speak? Might as well do this. Finally oh, get to see, see the, the boss. Harvest. <laughs> okay. Holy shit, was that 30 strength? Yeah, this guy's kind of scary. Uh, He's really fallen a long way. <laughs> yeah, funny. Uh, what is that? What is that skill he has? Or yeah, harvest. What? Is, I don't know what that is. Slow burn. What the fuck, Retina? Slow burn is a word? slow burn is like such an uh, su such a boss skill. Like it's such a skill to only have on bosses. Yeah. Because like, what are you uh, ever gonna do with a player unit? It's such a bad skill. When you said it's such a boss skill, I thought you were complimenting it. <laughs> no, 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 no. I meant specifically like it's such a skill yeah. to put on a boss. Um. I think I may have rigged a crit for the boss. No, I didn't rig, but I played like a loser. Like I was fighting fucking Henning. Um, I'm just gonna move you, because I know you don't get two shot, right? Yeah. So I'm just gonna move you right here. Get some avoid. Block the- no wait, you don't get an avoid from stairs. Well, you block the reinforcements, so that's something. Alright, then Hugh can just go here. Well, actually no. Better go up here. Kill you. I'm just never gonna use up that Thunder Tone because I don't need to. Yeah, that. I remember I did that a lot. Like, I had like a four use Thunder Tone. I held on to two. Like, I don't know if this were, but. Alright, then. Oh my god, I hate almost any oh. turn. Terrifying. Yeah, go ahead. Nice. Thanks, though. They're like on pace to be one of your. Sp units. Yeah. Oh, I, I jinx this perfect speed. It's fine. Then I heal you. Discord notice because I forgot to turn on D and D. Don't worry, I couldn't hear it on my end. I don't know if it comes through on your audio. No, no, no. I obviously, I pick it up. It just doesn't stream it. Oh, okay. <sighs> I guess Discord has built in not for that. Probably not your audio software. Yeah. And then. I guess I'll just... Extrovert Metathis? Nah, I think I'm just gonna give it to Wario. I don't feel like risking shit. I mean, I guess I could Axe River, but like... Uh, I think you should get the Metathis kill and heal Wario with like a Volner Elixir. Yeah. Fine. Have a rotten day. Oh my fucking god. 
I, I forgot how fucking strong he was. Uh, I think Metathis has a bomb. Oh yeah. He does. Just do that. Yeah, I think you just gotta like... Do the for train Lolina strategies off of Henning. If Arvis moves, I'm gonna kill someone. Adept, maybe? Oh god, I'm... Who the, the fuck, hell? It, you've not done one good thing this whole map. Delvin not doubling is just so well to me. Watch her be a third pirate out of nowhere. He's not proct adept. He has not dodged. Like, what is going on? There was a third pirate, but luckily... Oh, all right, I get it. It's time to move the fuck out of here. Do this. That's a devil axe. That's definitely not terrifying. Can you even board the boat from there? No. Okay. And then I just move... I guess I just move right here. Unless you can move there. To... The fuck. You're such, uh, you're you you're such a sp bad spot, oh, Charlo. I know what you do. Uh, you can just have him... Have Charlo heal someone else, and then just have uh, Priscilla rescue him and get out of there. True. True. You're not wrong. And I got one more turn to get that chest. And I sent everyone else up here. Right? Yeah. yeah. What is. Does um, Arvis have good red? Does... Probably not. Just. Yeah, prioritize yep. it. Oh, okay. Charlo, just get the he free heal. Then you run up here. You run over here. Like, every everybody just bum rush the boss. Delvin, go full speed. Get the- hold on. Just double checking. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that should be fine. Alright, I can't pick you up with you. I can't pick you up with you, so you're just gonna have to be stuck there. <laughs> Average Delvin L for this map, I guess. Alright, that's all I can do now. At least Burger King got a bit of extra experience. Definitely oh, not shit, scary. Okay, let's see if I can kill the boss now. Uh, because you, you can probably do it with all your ranged options. Yeah, Sephirim can get in range, right? 11, but I can also proc things. I can also get a crit the if I put Priscilla in out. range. Does, do they have, yeah, they have a support, so I might as well put her in range, right? Uh, I... This is annoying. Maybe have, like, uh, I could just get the chest first, just so we don't forget if you'd like crit kill the boss somehow. I guess. I just don't want to get the chest and then not be able to kill the boss and then lose the chapter because of that. Because we can definitely still survive one more turn if I don't, if I'm not able to kill the boss. Uh, yeah, I'd say. Uh, how does Sephirin do? Okay, uh, that is a lot better. You know what? I think I'm just okay. gonna stall for one more turn. You, I think between you and Sephirin, you can get the kill. Can I? Yeah. I, it'll have to hit all of it. 20? Uh, okay, let me check for the guaranteed hits. 20 plus. That's not guaranteed. That's not guaranteed. He does get more. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. No, I don't. Hmm. How about you? Everybody does do enough damage, it's just a matter of hitting. Honestly, this is kind of a boring map. Do you want to save state, or are you just bad against it? I'm pretty against it. Oh! <gasps> Sephirin support! I did think of that the second I moved Burger King there. Alright. Yeah, let's see how much Sephirin Honestly, you should get the chest now, just since Sephirin might fucking crit kill. Oh, now he now he hits with the vine. Oh, okay, we're we're good, we're good. Get the chest. That wasn't <laughs> worth it. Fuck Wait, you. Wait, what's the devil? I think it might be good on this hack. I can't remember. All right, let's look at the stats. Thirty-one minus luck, chance of backfire. Twenty-seven might though. Just, just, just the vine. If you get a crit, that would be great. <laughs> I forgot about this. Just Ostra. I'm sorry, it's peak. It's peak. It is.
got a lot of balls. Nice, level 2 out of it. Only level 4. Finally some speed. Holy crap, that's good. Yeah. That's great. Alright. Um, then I... So I'd say... Rescue... Yeah. Sephiroth with... Probably Mathis. Yeah. Then move like right here. Because the support still stays active, right? I think so. I do want to try Rebecca. I think I'm just going to move a Priscilla here. So I can get the Rebecca. Yeah. And support. then you could have Hugh kill Nish, probably. Yeah, probably. Oh, Rebecca just kills. Let's see if I can get do, do anything else over here. Can you hit? Might as well try. Yeah, go for it. Hell yeah. Free XP. Can Charlo do anything? Fallen. Probably not. I doubt Charlo can heal barrier. anyone. You haven't used Barrier yet, I feel like. Oh, true. Let's get the Barrier on Ricardo. <laughs> Let's <Yeah>. go! <laughs> nice. Okay. We should be good. I think we should be good. Yeah, there you go. There you go. There you go. Oh, <laughs> Alright, bad map, but I'm still good at Fire Emblem, so turned out okay. Average Rebecca W? Clearly. Still no strength. Still 0 for 0 <laughs> on strength. Stage killer! Uh, if you have a B side on hand, you should definitely use it on her. Well, no, after she gets to level 13. Just yeah. This bow break on a flyer is so fucking funny. Oh god, at least it wasn't an hour long video this time. Temple of what? Temple of Whopper. Oh my god. Why didn't I put that together? Whopper, 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 Whopper. <laughs> yeah, I, I had to end the episode on the unfunniest joke on the planet. Uh, oh, so true. Alright, but that was fine, I guess. Nice talks. Uh, yeah. Thanks for I watching. Really like and subscribe. <laughs> I really had to work you up by getting to talk about FE4 Remake. <laughs> FE4 Remake is going to happen. It's going to be fucking awesome. I hope it has Arvis. Oh, it'll have...